the Greek government has narrowly survived a crucial confidence vote in Parliament. The new cabinet's next task will be to win enough support for controversial austerity measures designed to save the country from bankruptcy. Europe correspondent Philip Williams reports. Outside the Parliament, the people with their message, no more cuts, sell-offs or sackings. But inside, the government had its own warning, accept the new cabinet or face chaos. The betting was the Prime Minister would survive, and he did, but not by much. This is just the beginning of a much harder sell. To convince everyone another round of savage cuts is not only desirable, but essential. But these people aren't listening anymore. What goodwill may have existed after the first round of cuts is rapidly evaporating. Well, this is what was put to them 18 months ago. And they responded by saying, OK, we'll take the, the, the bitter pill. The bitter pill nearly killed them. And now they're being asked to uh, hope uh, for better results from a larger dosage of the same pill. And they are simply not prepared to do this. And so already electricity workers have been on strike. Traffic is being brought to a standstill by protesters. As people lose faith in the ability of their politicians to find a way out of the mess. It's at stake is the future of Greece. In the danger that Greece is going to end up bankrupt is quite, quite serious. But while the government here says getting the next austerity package approved is essential, some believe default is the only way out. Others say that's far too risky and could lead to a default contagion that could damage everyone. Philip Williams, ABC News.